After a great lunch, we're heading for the Gaume wetlands. About 35 kilometers away, 40 minutes on the bus, the wind turbines soon coming into view. It's a very popular place to visit, especially at sunset. And as we arrive, it looks like we're in for a great sunset. The U-bikes, ubiquitous as usual. The typhoon of 2015 destroyed six of the 18 wind turbines. Some say they're ugly. I think the smog created from burning coal is more ugly. So we enjoy the smog-free air. A walkway has been constructed to allow visitors to keep their feet dry and the wildlife undisturbed. So we join the crowds and take the walk out, being reminded there's an abundance of wildlife here. The platform carefully constructed in such a way as to allow the visitor to observe the wildlife, which they certainly do. The fiddler crabs abundant as they search for the next meal. They're called fiddler crabs because as they use their claws to feed, they look like they're playing violins. I must say that I was fascinated by the fact that some have left claws, some have right claws, and some only have small claws. The simple reason is that the females have two small ones. And if the male loses the large claw, it will develop one on the opposite side after the next molt. These are two males, and they're about to fight, not mate. The small mudfish are also fascinating. They can exist out of the water by breathing through their skins, and even bury themselves and hibernate for months. Fascinating to watch it all. If you're here, don't just glance at the wildlife. Observe. So here's a shot of a crab fiddling. The big claw is the fiddle or violin. The walkway is made of wooden slats. I have to say that it was a very enjoyable walk out to the sea. The sun setting and the sights all around made for a wonderful afternoon. Looking back, it was colourful. Contrajour was a completely different feeling. Great for photography. We were fortunate to get a nice sunset.
At the end of the walkway, we all discarded our footwear to experience the sea. And get our pictures. Shooting into the sun, delivering dynamic images. It was really an enjoyable afternoon. So back to Taichung, anticipating our next place to visit, the famous night market. Next time we visit the Taichung night market, meet the people, Enjoy the sights and sample the food. Great fun.